What's up guys, this is Caden. It is February 28th, 2015, and tomorrow is my 11 months on T. Uh, it's kind of crazy that next month is my one year because I really never thought I would get this far in my transition. I used to watch a bunch of T montage videos on YouTube, uh, pre-testosterone, and I just dreamt of being there one day and it's really surreal that I am here and that I've gotten this far in my transition. Um, so far I am on, as of now, I'm on 0.4 cc's uh, which I'm happy about. I like this dose, it works well for me. Last month I had a problem with my dose being too high and I just had a lot of anxiety and just very emotionally unstable so right now I'm doing really really well uh, on my dose. Mentally, I'm pretty good. I've been dealing with a lot of dysphoria. Uh, yeah, uh, my bottom dysphoria has always been a problem. And since like a month or two ago, it's just really been an issue for me. Uh, I have a really good friend of mine who is going to be giving me his uh, free time, which is a four in one Hacker STP and play uh, prosthetic, which I'm really, really happy about. I'm, I've always wanted one, I just never had enough money to get one. So I think that would help with my bottom dysphoria. Um, and I never, like, talking about my chest, I always had a smaller chest pre T, but now since I gained a lot of weight, um, not a lot of weight, but I've gained 25, 30 pounds since starting T. Um, I do have a chest now, which does cause me a lot of dysphoria. I am getting surgery August 17th of 2015. I'm so fucking stoked, and I cannot wait for August to roll around. I am getting a uh, keyhole procedure done by Dr. Arasso. Uh, in Mountain View, which is really close to me. I'm really happy I found a good click, good, good surgeon in a area that's close to me so I don't really have to travel and spend a bunch of money on that. I'm still working with Flaunt Streetwear to help me raise money so you guys can check them out. They're a small queer business helping me raise money for my top surgery. Um, as of changes goes, I feel like I've grown a lot more facial hair than ever before which I'm excited about. I have to shave this, I don't know if you can see. I have to shave this every like three or four days. I keep it like a little stubble just cause I like how that looks. I can't really grow it out because of work. Um, my mustache does not grow in as fast, but that's okay. My hair has definitely changed. The texture of my hair is a lot. Um, it's thinner, it's also more rough. I don't really know how to explain that. I used to have like a lot of hair, uh, very thick, kind of softer hair, and now it's a lot more thick, and just the texture has definitely changed. I guess it's more coarse, or I don't know. Like when I when I don't shave my head and I let it grow out, it just gets like it's not really my hair is really straight, but it's just like goes in a bunch of weird different directions. <laughs> it's kind of funny. Um, muscle mass. I've definitely got a lot bigger shoulders. Um, my arms have gotten bigger. Overall, muscle mass has really improved. I've been trying to eat a lot more and just bulk up uh, because I do have dysphoria about how skinny I am. My hips, I feel like finally went somewhere. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I have this weird, like I have really bad scoliosis, so one rib always sticks out more than the other. But like here, it's not as indented, which I'm really happy about because I had a lot of hip dysphoria, uh, pre-testosterone, because of how tiny I was and like how much my hips kind of glitched out. So I feel like my hips finally went somewhere. Um, 
my legs have gotten a lot bigger, my thighs are a lot bigger, my ankles are still very small, but whatever, it's kind of chilly. <laughs> um, my neck has gotten a lot bigger. You can, like this is very noticeable to a lot of people. Um, yeah, I like pretty much overall how I'm starting to look for once in my life. And that's a great feeling. I'm really starting to feel happy with myself and how I'm thinking and just how everything is going for me. I've been um, getting into oils and soap making and body scrubs and shampoos and just all natural uh, products to use on your body. I've always been very interested in this, but I never really had the time to sit down and do a lot of research like I am doing now. So I'll keep you guys updated on that. That's a new hobby of mine. Um, I haven't been working out because I've been sick for like a month, which is really weird. I've never been this sick uh, for such like long periods of time. But yeah, so I haven't really been working out just because I've been feeling pretty shitty. But I'm gonna start doing yoga again. The weather here has been really freaking weird. Like right now, it it was sprinkling this morning. It looks like it's about to rain. But I like doing yoga outside, and I haven't really had a chance <coughs> to do that. Uh, voice I think has dropped a little more. Oh my god, my cats are just climbing. Get this cat. I don't even know if you could see her, but she's freaking nuts. But yeah, my voice, I feel like, has dropped. My voice doesn't drop. It just consistent. Shh, come here. Come here. <laughs> my voice just consistently gets a little lower. My cat has no idea what to do because I'm in her way. Um... So yeah, I've been just trying to focus on myself and getting myself... Ooh. Where'd you go? <laughs> um, getting myself healthy and uh, yeah, I'm going to quit smoking cigarettes next month because of my top surgery. Quit pretty much everything. I don't really drink. I drink very occasionally. I have like two beers and I'm drunk, so <laughs> I don't really need much, but I don't really like to drink. I never really like to drink. But I'm going to quit smoking cigarettes and pretty much any substance that I'm using uh, so I can be healthy for top surgery. So yeah, that's pretty much my update for this month. If you guys notice any changes, let me know. I would love to chat about them. Alright. Well, I'll make some videos soon. I'll make some videos soon on this channel. I have a collab channel going on as well which I am on every week, so you guys can check that out. I'll put everything in the description so you guys can see. That's my cat. Alright, well, I will catch you guys later, and have a good day.